It has been reported that nearly one in five people in the nation are living with a disability. Many will face discrimination, bullying, or other lifelong challenges. Easter Seals offers a variety of services to help address these issues and help Americans with disabilities achieve successful lives. Youth leadership is an integral part of this process. I'm Jenny Johnson for Comcast Newsmakers at the New Hampshire Institute of Politics at St. Anselm College. Colleen Flanagan, Youth Service Coordinator of Easter Seals of Massachusetts, joins me. Colleen, welcome to the program. Thank you for having me. So who are the program youth leaders and what do they do? Well, the Easter Seals Youth Leadership Network is um, young people with any kind of disability between the ages of 14 and 26. They might have really high incident disabilities like ADHD, or learning disabilities, and some have or autism spectrum disorders, and some have um, less, you know, rare, more rare disabilities. Um, the goal is to bring all, because lots of public schools have a, a very high percentage of students in special education and who have disabilities. So our goal is to bring them all together so they have a sense of unity, and they also um, have a purpose, which they're doing, they're coming together to work on something to make the world a better place. Now, so what is the Easter Seals Youth Leadership Network? Well, the network is the many, many youth that are across Massachusetts um, between the ages of 14 and 26 with various disabilities, like I said, and they have once a month meetings in different cities across Massachusetts. And at those meetings, we um, give them opportunities to develop leadership and advocacy skills so they can be stronger adults in the very near future, hopefully employed adults. Because mm -hmm. um, as you may know, many um, adults with disabilities are not working. And um, that is something that we're hoping these young people, through developing leadership and advocacy skills, can change. That they can become more employed than the generation before them. So the network provides a lot of great opportunities. Talk about the campaign Don't Disability. Don't Disability is the campaign that the network works under. So not only do they come together once a month to develop their own skills to be stronger leaders in their own lives, they come together to advocate that bullying should no longer be accepted um, towards youth with disabilities or adults with disabilities. So how do these youth leaders step up to fight bullying? Bullying is such a big deal. What do they do to step up to it? Well, first and foremost, the Don't Disability campaign includes a t-shirt. So it's a logo that the youth came up with um, that signifies that we, sh we all should respect abilities. Everybody has an ability and everybody has an ability that they're not that proud of or that isn't their strongest ability. So the, what, they wear the t-shirts um, to show that there's many, many of them. We do rallies and different things um, and to show that ability, all ability should be respected and never disrespected or um, youth shouldn't stand for discrimination. Speaking of some of the things that mm -hmm. you do, Easter Seals every July holds a youth leadership forum. What happens at these forums? Well, the forum is actually a really great place. Um, it's many, many youth who um, apply from across the state of Massachusetts to go away um, on a college dormitory for three days and two nights. And they um, participate in workshops, they hear from guest speakers, around things that might help them in their adult lives, but they also um, get to experience a little bit of disability pride. Because we don't really talk about disability, it's kind of a, a shameful thing in a lot of communities and families, it's just how it's been. Um, but it's so normal. and pretty much everybody is affected by it because everybody knows somebody mm -hmm. usually. How that, important is the peer-to-peer is the -peer mentoring? Well, that's pretty important because oftentimes youth are the only um, student in their school. Um, they might feel like they're the only ones who have a disability. Um, so it's important for them to connect. Yeah, because there isn't a lot of bringing them together and that's what don't disability does because they come together to say don't disrespect ability. Mm -hmm. And it's great for them to be part of something that hopefully will make a difference. Well, Colleen, thanks for sharing a little bit about Easter Seals Massachusetts with us. Thank you for having me. Yeah. Thanks for watching Comcast Newsmakers. I'm Jenny Johnson.